right, I am at the Solano Salinity Control Facility near Bird's Landing in California. And we are going to do a test of the Maven app using the DJI Mavic Air 2. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open the Air Map app. I'm going to check the airspace around me. Looks like I'm good. There's some warnings there. I've got... First responder activity in Pittsburgh. That's quite a ways away. That's not going to be an issue. And I've got some power plants that are near here, but outside the area I'm going to be flying, so I'm good. I do have some Class D airspace for Concord south of me. That's far enough away that's not going to be an issue. Next, I'm going to use the Kitty Hawk app to check the weather. Um, got eight miles an hour gust to 16, pretty windy out here, but we'll see how the DJI Mavic Air 2 handles that. And now we're gonna open the Maven app. See, I'm not connected to the drone. I'm gonna go to Waypoint and create a new mission. Should zoom into where I'm at. See the Solano Salinity Control Facility. So I'm going to do this as a point of interest flight. So I'm going to touch the gear. Mission configuration. I'm going to call this birds. Well, birds landing. And it defaults to 3 meters per second or 7 miles an hour. I'm going to bump that up to about 10. My heading is going to be defined by waypoints. The gimbal pitch angle is going to be defined by waypoints. And after I'm done, I'm going to go home. I've got a curved flight path. Hopefully that will be nice and smooth. And I'm going to add a POI. So let's put the point of interest right on top of the gates there. And now let's start adding waypoints. So I am parked right about here. Let's put the first waypoint there. So I'm going to do a long hold to add a waypoint. And now I'm going to go in and edit that waypoint. So I'm going to take that up to about 100 feet, 30 meters. The corner radius default is set to 33 feet or 10 meters, and I want my drone to point at that point of interest the entire time. The gimbal pitch angle is set to stay at the point of, uh, point of interest, so that'll change as it goes. And I want my action on that to be start recording. And it'll start recording once it gets to that waypoint. All right, let's add some more, some more waypoints. So we'll go straight from that first one, staying at the same altitude. See the plus in between. If I want to add a waypoint there, I can. Touch that plus. If I want to move one of these waypoints, I can do that as well. So now I've got three, and let's go ahead and just add some waypoints around our point of interest. You see the little purple arrowhead shows where the drone is going to point as it does this. So I've got eight waypoints to find. That's a pretty good first flight. Um, on the last waypoint, I want it to stop recording. Now, looking at it, that angle between waypoint three and four is kind of steep, so I can touch waypoint three and drag that over. Let's drag it a little bit more. 
All right, I'm going to touch the little disc to save that. And now let's hook up the drone and go fly this to see how it works. All right, we are in the Maven app. And I've got good satellites. See the roads closed there. I'm going to go ahead and take the drone up. The home point has been updated. I Please check it on the map. You try and fly this mission. So tap to start. Home point has been updated. And I'm going to select the three dots. I'm going to select the waypoint mission. I'm going to select the bird's landing that mission that we just built. And I'm going to touch the rocket and run that mission. So the drone is climbing up. It's going to the predetermined altitude flying to the first waypoint. Once we get to the first waypoint, it should start recording. Reach the first waypoint. have we and we've started recording so now it's going to move on through the other waypoints there. It's locked in at 10 miles an hour. You notice that the image in the little inset box there is hasn't changed. Let's switch over to see if nope. All right, that's not changing. See the drone turning as it reaches the waypoint to keep pointed at that point of interest. Approaching the last waypoint here.
I'm still moving to point at that point of interest. And now it's mission complete. Aircraft is climbing to my preset return to home altitude. And now is moving back to the home point. Pretty windy out there, so I'll be interested to see how this footage comes out. It's pretty gusty. A lot of variance between the wind. Altogether, I'd say that was a pretty successful test of the Maven app. Uh, pretty well worth the $15 I paid for the app. Thank you and hope you enjoyed this video.